So the good news is the application process is pretty straightforward. My twins actually went on the site this morning and told me not only was the form pretty simple, but it also took them both minutes to complete. So here's what you need to know. The only website to apply on is at studentaid.gov slash debt relief. In addition to your full name and date of birth, you will have to provide your social security number. You do not need your federal student aid ID or FSA ID to apply for forgiveness and proof of income is not required unless the education department follows up with an additional request. Make sure your loan servicer as well as the Department of Education has your most recent contact information. You could update that at studentaid.gov. Now, just as a reminder, borrowers will be eligible to have up to $10,000 wiped off of their student loan balance or up to $20,000 if they received a Pell Grant. If you don't know whether you received a Pell Grant, don't worry about it. The Department of Education actually has that information already, and the application doesn't even ask you for it. Now, after you apply, you will receive an email confirmation from the Education Department. When your request is approved, you'll receive an email from your loan servicer when the forgiveness has been applied to your account. Only respond to these emails from the addresses you see on your screen right now. And you know I have to warn you to watch out for scams. So do not pay to apply. Even if someone says they can get your forgiveness faster, that's just simply false. Only apply on the Department of Education's website. If someone asks you for your bank or credit card information to apply, you're on the wrong website. Just head to NBCWashington.com and click on the link to start your application. I'm Susan Hogan, News 4.